The Death Wheel was a massive Dalek craft built in orbit around the planet Hell at some point during the Second Dalek War. The Death Wheel was a doomsday weapon overseen by the Dalek Emperor, which was to be used as part of Operation Genocide. The testing of this weapon would involve eradicating the entire population of the planet Hell, which was occupied by the local Helkins. Originally traders who dealt in the export of the planet's natural gases, the Helkins were enslaved by the Daleks and forced to construct the Death Wheel. Many of the Helkins were worked to death, but when the Seventh Doctor and Absalom Dak arrived, the survivors were inspired to rise up in rebellion and fought back against their Dalek oppressors. Using the Helkagen gas, the Daleks intended to power the Death Wheel and begin Operation Genocide, but the wheel was sabotaged by Dalek killer Absalom Dak, who flew a hoverbelt into the Death Wheel's core, intending to sacrifice himself to destroy the weapon. He was transmatted out at the last second and survived, but he was still successful in destroying the Death Wheel, dealing a significant blow to the Daleks. Though the Death Wheel was destroyed, it was not the last huge space station superweapon that the Daleks would construct. During the Time War, the Daleks had several huge stations housing deadly weapons of war, such as the Eternity Circle's Command Station and Station Alpha, the secret research facility overseen by the Dalek Commandant who would go on to become Dalek Thay of the Cult of Skara. After the Time War, the Daleks of Davros's new Dalek Empire would go on to build the Crucible, a space station housing their reality bomb that served a very similar function to the Death Wheel and met a similar fate. What's your opinion on the Death Wheel? Have you read the Nemesis of the Daleks comic? Would you like to see this story adapted as an episode of New Who? Let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to click below to subscribe to Dalek Bumps.